Well, what can I say? My first week in Sydney was wet. Um, you might have seen it on the news. There were floods and it made the worldwide news, actually. Um, and <laughs> that made touristing a little difficult. Um, but I did uh, get along uh, to the Sea Life Centre um, and to the Wildlife Experience. And um, they're next to each other and I got one of those three attractions for $70 type passes. Um, they were both rammed because it was wet and it was the school winter holidays. Um, but they were really good. Um, and I saw a few different fish um, that that was very cool. I saw uh, the sharks, as you can see there, and that was very cool. And my personal favourite was the dugong. Uh, that's what I really wanted to go and see um, and he came super close up and said hello. They call him Pig um, and that was brilliant. Um, it was great to go around and do something just really touristy. Um, I totally recommend uh, you go and, um, well, to any Sea Life Centre, but particularly that one. I love the Sea Life Centres and uh, there's one in Scarborough where I grew up, so it's somewhere I've been a lot as a kid. Um, so I'd definitely check that out if you're ever in Sydney. The other thing I did that is next door, so is in this same video, was the wildlife experience. Like Sea Life, it's owned by the same people, I think, but it's, I guess, animals. <laughs> it was chucking it down and there were some very sad looking kangaroos. I think I took a picture of them, but uh, if not, they were, and it's not up now, they were very, very sad. Um, there was also some cool animals that were nocturnal. There was this huge, as you can see there, this huge alligator, and he was awesome. And um, there was also the chance uh, to get up close and personal with these koala bears. Oh, I really loved that. Um, I'm going to go to another zoo and I'll do a bigger video on there. But oh, it was so cool. So fun to get up close with a koala bear. I wasn't allowed to touch them, which I think I'm pleased about. Um, I wanted to, I wanted to give it a cuddle, but I think it's uh, best for them. Um, and it was just a great exercise in how good and how creative is our God. You know, you see all these fish and animals and uh, birds of the air. You know, we see them in, we hear of them in the creation account and we see them in everyday life and how amazingly creative is our God. And um, for me, I always love that. I love animals and I love seeing uh, creation, but as someone who is creative and who likes to do creative things for their job, it is fantastic to just marvel at the animals. Um, yeah, would recommend there as well. Um, let me, uh, I'll put the link at the bottom for both of those so that if you're ever in Sydney, you can, uh, find out more but uh, honestly check them out they're brilliant